What's up friends? Back in the food forest with some good results for you. Let's go in and check this one out. So we started an experiment a couple weeks ago with the egg in the hole underneath our tomatoes in this area. Let me take you in a little bit closer. You can see these 12 tomatoes right here. All got buried with the egg underneath the digging hole. Some of them weren't as deep as we wanted because you can see a little bit of eggshell right there. The main reason you go deep is to keep pests away. That could be one of the problems of using this method. But we got lucky and we haven't had any raccoons or anything over here digging. So this is our biggest one right here. It's pretty impressive. And this whole right over, this whole row right here was planted without an egg in the hole. A little black raspberry sharing some room. But you can see a pretty dramatic difference. Actually, none of these got an egg in the hole. But this row up front was planted at the same time that these were. And there's just a pretty big difference. Uh, the stem wa walls look thicker. The stem itself looks thicker. Overall health of the plant, they're a little bit greener. Definitely more leaves. Got some set in blossoms already. So I would say the egg buried under a tomato is a legitimate way to increase the growth. And it definitely adds calcium to the soil, which is going to be uptaken by the plant and makes it more pest and disease resistant, makes stronger stems. We covered this on the last video over here. We got some salad coming up between our tomatoes, onions going out. Just starting to prep over here. Get another row of tomatoes in. Got our little square foot garden doing good over here. Got the daikon radish. These get huge. So that'll still get quite a bit bigger. And then a tomato will be popping up through there. Nice healthy cucumber starting to spread. We're going to try to get that off of the mound and give this stuff some other, a little bit of room here. But yeah, I just wanted to show you the difference over there. It's a pretty big difference. You can see it from here for sure. Let me step back a little bit. Can't even hardly pick the ones up on the left. And the ones on the right are definitely the strongest tomatoes in the garden so far. So I'm going to say that's a go. Put your egg in the hole. Maybe you can also, uh, if you make hard boiled eggs or anything like that, deviled eggs, you can take that water and that water itself, and once it cools down, it's good to water your plants with. It's real easy for them to uptake it. And that water has increased level of both calcium and potassium, which is good for plants. Another thing you can do if you're at all worried about pests is just use your eggshells. That's a common discard kitchen nowadays. So yeah, I just want to show you that experiment. I think it worked. We'll see you on the next one.